Hello, good morning, students. Today we will learn about nouns like um, like sangya. Yes, noun is defined as a the name of any person, place, things, or an animal name is called noun. Noun is also called naming words. Like example of my brother is going to school. The dog bark. Milk is good for health. Delhi is capital of India. There is a brother. Dog. Milk. Delhi and India is your noun. Yes. There is a six kinds of noun. First is proper noun. Common noun. Collective noun. Abstract noun. Material noun, countable and uncountable noun. Now we discuss all nouns one by one. Your first noun is proper noun. What's the meaning of proper noun? It gives special name to a particular person, animal, place or thing. Seema is my sister. I live in Delhi. Like Seema and Delhi is your proper noun. It's defined the proper like I am your teacher. Like a pinky ma'am is your teacher. Yes, pinky. So it's your proper noun. Second, your common nouns. The same kind of name of person, place or things. Like Meerut is a big city. We all eat food to live. City and food. There is a city used for a Meerut and food used for R. So there is a city and food is a your common Noun. We use common for our staff, students also. Your third noun is what? Collective nouns. Your collective noun meaning is meaning is the name of a collection of person, place, things or animals considered as one whole. Yes, it's a called a like a group. Neha saw a flock of sheep. Yes, flock. Meena has lost a bunch of keys. Bunch. That is used for a group. Like a sheep group, flock and keys group called bunch. It's a, also called for a, like a staff and like a crowd used for collective nouns. Yes, your fourth noun is abstract noun. What's the meaning of abstract noun? Abstract noun meaning is Abstract noun meaning is like a, you have any quality, feeling or idea. Name of any idea and quality that is called your abstract noun. Like you can not touch the any feeling and you can cannot touch your idea. It's, that's why it's a called abstract noun. Abstract noun they said, tell me the truth is your example. We should have humanity. The truth and humanity you cannot touch and you cannot see this. Okay. That's why we, we call abstract noun. Humanity and truth, cries, sad, sad feeling is not you cannot touch. Never. Okay. Like a, your fifth noun is material noun. Material noun means you, your things things uh, made by any material like silver gold and your iron any material like stone also used for a material and a floor a cement it is also called a material there is a any material used for any substance like a thing yes it's called your material noun it's your example material example is what yes your first example is yes sort the example yes example is your first is the chapatis is made from flour the baby cries for milk there is a flour and milk is your material yes flour and milk because chapatis is made from flour and baby cries for milk there is a flour and milk is your material gold silver iron it's also your material and cement is also your material 
and your next is uh, your fifth is uh, uh, abstract noun your last and six countable and uncountable noun yes countable noun means you can count and uncountable means you cannot count like soup here leaf you cannot count it's your uncountable noun and you can count your things like a uh, two pence three pence there is any number that is called your countable noun and the example is your also uh, mentioned here first your example is uh, the girls are dancing well there is a girls but it's a uncountable noun because no mention how many girls are dancing it's your uncountable noun then your second example is i have two red pants so how many red pants two red pants there is a mention also two so it's your countable noun because you can count your pants red pants it's a two red pants it's your nouns yes your last example mentioned there is a countable noun and your first example is girls are dancing well it's your uncountable noun yes write down write down in your notebook if you don't have understand please message us okay thank you and have a good day